eye-opening. Stressful. <laughs> Enriching. Exhilarating. Educational, but very stressful. Fantastic. It's a challenge. Humanizing challenge. Yeah, it, it humanized engineering. It was cool. Mind-blowing. Astonishing. Crazy. Amazing. It's too hard to put it into words. It's incredible. Of all the competitions here, this is the one that's like, no, this is exactly what's going to happen in the future. Like, there, there's no doubt about it. This is not the game of memorizing terms and memorizing strategies. This is thinking outside the box. This is identifying constraints of current manufacturing and, and having the, the courage to push for more. We're at the Skills USA National Championships in Louisville, Kentucky. This is a competition for secondary and post-secondary students in all types of skills, trades, uh, areas where they get to compete against uh, other states. Stratasys is the global leader in additive manufacturing, which is also known as 3D printing. So we partnered with Society of Manufacturing Engineers, SME, uh, to create and cultivate the additive manufacturing competition. Additive manufacturing is a very important technology and a perfect technology to introduce students into manufacturing and engineering. Well, this competition is more of like an opportunity for us to showcase what we've learned through our classes that we've taken, through what we've picked up on our own. It's been really exciting over the past few years to watch it grow year over year to see more diverse students, to see more girls. In our first year, we had one girl participating, and this year we have 13. So it's quite a journey over three days. The students come here, they don't even know what they're gonna do. So they come in with a, a blank slate. Uh, we give them the contest rules, and we let them design. We've tasked our students with creating an adaptive device to enable this veteran who had a partial thumb amputation and his favorite pastime is playing video games to be able to, to participate in his favorite hobby. It was a great honor being a veteran, being able to make a prosthetic for a veteran. So we went, what exactly is he looking for? What is it that he wants? What kind of guy are we dealing with? Specifically going around to him. Once they complete the first design time, they submit their files, we print them overnight for them. They can make design adaptations or iterations, and then they get another three hours to design again. The final day ends up with them presenting to real industry judges where they show how the device works and they get judged on that. This is the Stratasys Continuous Build 3D printer, printing 12 different heads at one time and so it speeds the process up tremendously. And then the automation, it spits out the part, it trims the part, and it starts the next part with a zero human intervention. You can just have it queued up and it'll just run all night. The continuous yeah. build printers are completely new to me. I didn't even know they existed. This technology has come so far and it's absolutely amazing. The students light up when they see the capabilities of the technology. For me, it was like magic. Like we did this on the computer and now we have something in our hand. It was amazing. I know people that are in industry that spend you know, months and multiple iterations coming up with complex geometries and, and these kids within a couple hours you know, are coming up with amazing designs. It's really great to walk around and just see what each of the students are doing. Um, the designs are all so different but also creative. It's great to see them testing the parts on the different testing rigs we have here and it's going to be great to just see the changes that they've made. I think we did pretty well. Uh, we got 100% for both of our the past two days. Uh, I feel like it turned out really well. There could be like a few tweaks to be made, but that's always going to happen in manufacturing. The growth that I saw in my students and the actual exposure to a professional environment and getting to work with Stratasys during this intense competition grew these gentlemen um, more than I could do in the classroom in three months. If I keep having students like this that are so creative, I'm not retiring until they drag me out of the classroom. They know their game. It's fun to work with them, and, and again, I lose track of their age. Like the professionalism they show is something that I'd see from coworkers and not all of my coworkers. These students are our next leaders in the manufacturing space, in the 3D printing, in the design space. These students give me hope for America in the future. These guys are the future of the country. This is why our country is gonna be great in the future, and uh, I hope we can produce more like them. Still good.